My name is David Wynn. And today's topic and my purpose is to share with you guys the trials of running towards your journey. What is your journey? You guys know I'm here to motivate and inspire you to pursue a passion and dream that's unlimited that you thought that you cannot do unless you had the faith. <laughs> so yesterday, I chose to run three miles at Memorial Park. Anybody ever run at Memorial Park? Okay, three miles. That's just envision a high school track running four times. That's one mile times three. It was a goal for me to achieve that goal in at least seven minutes. As I started that journey, I could deal with any other passion or dream I had. I believed in myself. I had the faith. I can do this. I could run around this track less than 25 minutes if I believe myself that I can do it. So when you start off a journey, it's about that first step. That first step that you take, even though you cannot see the whole staircase, as a great Dr. Martin Luther King has once said. It's that first step. Even though I can't see around three miles of this track, but I know I can do it. I have a goal to reach and I will achieve it. So as I'm running, I'm feeling good, taking those first few steps. Wow, this journey is not too bad at all. Sun's coming down, but I got some light beam in my eyes. Just like when you start that journey for a new business or a new passion, you get this light coming in your eyes. You start off, you feel good. You feel good in your first few days in January of 2016. You have this light, you there's, there's a light. What are you showing to me? I keep running. My heart's starting to pump up. My cardio's going fast. Starting to feel a little challenge. Knees are hurting. I shouldn't have worn these shoes because now my feet's hurting on this gravel ground. I'm pursuing my business dream. I'm going to become an entrepreneur. I'm going to have my own destiny in my hands. But why is it so difficult now? Why am I pursuing this, Lord? And you're telling me you're going to take care of me not to fear, but I'm going through these struggles. I need some help. I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep on running. I'm sweating. Someone faster runs past me. Why is he running faster? Why is he getting past the goal? Nice Mercedes Benz Park. Not trying to get distracted. I see that vision. I'm going to keep on running. Don't get distracted by that. Don't focus on the material. Don't focus on the money. Focus on your passion, the reason why you're ignited to pursue. Focus on that. Don't get distracted. Don't let people flash their vision to your dreams and distract you from your vision from God. So as I'm running, two miles in the game, I see the water fountain. That water looks good. Lord, you said if I receive your word like the river streams of the open floodgates from heaven will come down on me. If I receive your word like the living water. But why am I struggling? I have faith in you and this is what you're doing to me. I don't understand. But I can't give up. I'm going to keep on running. I have a goal. I have faith. I'm already hurting. Might as well get something done. Might as well get something out of it. I might as well pursue my goal. Hi, nice lady running by. <laughs> Don't get distracted. Stay single. Focus on your dreams. Be the best that you can be so that you can be the best man for your husband and the father of your children. Financially secure. Confidently secure. Spiritual secure. Your character develop. Eternal life that you open up doors for your family. Your community, your people. This is why you chose this path. This is who you're going to become. I'm almost done running. Deep breath. I got this last quarter mile. My quads are hurting. They're burning. My ankles are sore. Five more people running past me. Why are they finishing faster than me? Shoes are nicer than mine. Got a nice tank top. Water bottle squirting over themselves. They're looking great. How come you're taking care of them? Why are they ahead of me? Why did I have negative in my bank account? You told me I could put all my trust into you. Because I see what's inside of you. I see the value, the investment you put in me. I see the growth that you put. I see the mindset. I see the impact lives throughout this journey that you inspire so they can go into their own journey. I'm creating something inside of you. I'm going to keep on running. I'm almost there. 
Finish line is right there. I see the vision. I see my goal. And I finished. And when I finish, it's not about the goal of running around. It was not about the money. It was not about the material. It was not about that nice lady that I want to take on the day on Valentine's Day, but I guess I can't. <laughs> it's about who I became, who I would convert into. The Temple Construction Project of going for any dreams or any opportunities for your growth. And now today, I'm growing. And I thank you for running that miles. I have faith in you, Lord, that you will put me through any struggle, any adversity that will turn to a blessing. So my vision is set on my goal. So these are my running trials to my journey. Thank you. Thank you.